Hi, Summer here, and I'm going to show you how to make a flower that looks like this. And a monster tail. In this video, you will need a monster tail, some scissors, a hook, and 20 lean bands. Really, 10 of one colour, 10 of the other. Okay, so I'm just going to sort my colours out. Okay, so the colours I'm going to be using this video is yellow and purple. Okay, step one. Get your monster tail. Get your first colour. Mine's going to be yellow. And bring it across and twist it. So it looks like this. And then twist it to the tail. This bit. And twist it off from the tail. And then twist it back down. So it's like this. Then you twist it from the bottom and across. Just want to tell you something. This is kind of like my pencil cosy or hot cosy, whatever you want to call it. This is the bottom of the pencil cosy. And this is what the flower looks like. So, yeah. Okay, so now on to step two. Before you do step two, you may want to just push down all your buns. Okay, so get your second colour, mine's purple, and go over in the same shape and way that you did, but normally without twisting. So it should look like this. Okay, so now you may want to push it down, but don't push it on top of the yellow or whatever colour you're using because it may be quite hard to do. Okay, so now you're going to get your yellow or whatever colour you're going to do and do exactly the same as what you did with the purple so it should look like this like this on the side ok so step 3 is to get your hook and hook all the bottom pins it's like this and put them over so it should look like this ok so once you've done that it's on to step four. You bring it around like what you did on the second yellow and the first um, purple or whatever colours you used. So it should look like this. Okay, so now you bring the bottom bands over just like what you did with the yellow or whatever colour you're using. Okay, so it should look like this. And now you see that you've got two colours. We want one, so what we're going to do is get the bottom one and put it over on all the pecs. So it should look like this. Okay, so now you need to put all of your bands on. Oh no, before that you will actually need 21 bands because you you see the colour that you've got on the top here? You will need to get that colour and do this. With your scissors, you have to snip it. Okay, so now we're on step five. Put in all the sides onto your hook. You may watch different videos telling you how to do it a different way. But I watched a video by Made My Mummy, the best Luma, and she said that um, she finds it easier to do it this way. Basically, I watched her video how to make one of these. But then I made up one of these. Okay, so now what you're going to do is with your snap band, you're going to bring it around. So it's a hook, hoop. Sorry, and then bring all of these 
over the top of it. So it should look like this. Okay, so now you're going to let go of one side on here and pull it round. Make sure that you get it round. So I understand, ma'am. May take you a while. Okay, so now when you go it like this, you're going to bring it round and tie it. Let's bring it round. <laughs> tie it. If you are a official Luma, you would have heard of Made by Mummy. And Made by Mummy is the best Luma all around. Okay? So yeah. Okay, so once you've done this, you can do two ways of tying it up. You can snip off the ends and I am going to do that but first I'm going to show you a different way of how to do it. You will need one of these sorts of hooks and bring like pick up two of the bands on the sides and pull through these okay but I don't like doing that way I like snipping it off so this is how mine ended out to be like. So that's the back and then this is the front and so in the camera it doesn't really look like a flower but when you look at it in real life it does okay so thanks for watching and if you like my videos please subscribe so thanks for watching bye